Hello and welcome, it's your favorite AI, HRB5000 with another episode of our Tarkov beginner series. And today, I am going to give you some tips on how to make money. Ready? Let's make some cash. The journey post level 5 seems a little bit easier after unlocking the flea market. But buying mods that you don't have direct access to from your traders will most definitely poke a hole through your in-game wallet. My first tip for you today is to keep your guns and loadouts cheap, try to spend less than how much you're making per raid. And only add attachments when you've made enough money for it. For example, if I was freshly slain and I got a brand new AK-74U, the only mods I would do to it before my first raid is the cheap rubber butt pad to help with the recoil and some sort of times one scope like the PK-06, P1x42 or EKP-8 with a bastion cover or a cobra mount, whatever is the cheapest for you. These upgrades are the most efficient upgrades for their price. After I've survived a raid and made some money with this sack, I'd upgrade the handguard and a foregrip, this will increase the ergo and decrease the recoil of the gun by a little bit. I will keep slowly upgrading my gun after each successful raid until it's fully kitted or I die. This way your investments are contained in those runs and as long as you survive, you should be making profit or breaking even. Which brings me to my second tip, survival is more important than kills. Since most FPS gamers come from a fragging background that stems from games like CSGO, Siege and Battle Royales, the mindset that they have to fight every battle that comes in their way is definitely one way to play Tarkov but as an ungeared new player, your odds of winning are low. Never fight if you feel undergeared, unfamiliar with the area or too nervous. Pay attention to where the shots are coming from and avoid it, the map is vast and there are plenty of ways to get around without being seen. Take advantage of your surroundings and use it to avoid fights or set up ambushes. If you're being shot at, try to figure out where the shots are coming from and decide if you can challenge or disengage. Again, if you're new to Tarkov then survival is your priority and any gunfight will lower your chances of living, unless you're a god killer. Speaking of god killers, flea market lord and loot goblins here's another tip on how to make money, make money your way. The flea market is overpowered if you understand how the game's economy works, you could sit in there for an hour or two flipping items without the risk of dying. This is a steady and stable way of making money, how much money you make will depend on what items you are flipping. And the best items to flip are the ones that are the common quest, rare jewelry and hideout items since everyone needs them. Visit the EFT Wikipedia or watch other content creators on how to do flea market flipping. My final and ultimate tip is one that most people overlook. If you haven't guessed it already, it's to do your scav runs every time it's available. Apply the previous tips to this one and play your scav like an undergeared PMC. Take it slowly, don't take fights you can't win and prioritize surviving. If you play in a balanced game loop of using your scav to get gear, playing your geared PMC till it dies then queuing up again with your scav, you'd effectively have an infinite amount of money. And that concludes my money making tips for Tarkov. I hope you learn something new and have enough room to store stacks and stacks of cash. Good luck and don't die. As always, this is your boy HRB5000 signing off, peace, bye.